Good morning, everyone. Buenos dias. Buenos dias. It is good to be back on the stage at the USACC National Convention. And it was a great honor to receive the Chamber of the Year Award last year. A great achievement, indeed, for us at the National Area Hispanic Chamber of Commerce. I wanted to thank our board directors and our delegation attending the convention this year. We are in Tennessee. And we are about to celebrate our 20 year anniversary next year, so they're great news. I wanted to thank the USAC board directors, the USACC, for, because now I'm a, a newly added board member to this great organization. I have the great honor of representing a market with an estimated 1,500 uh, Hispanic-owned businesses. Businesses of all sizes that collectively contribute millions of dollars to our local economy and region. We also advocate on behalf of several major American corporations who partner with us to help us carry our mission. We, at the, U at the NAACC, advocate for business owners, men and women of Hispanic descent, that are first and foremost American businesses. We all are instrumental in moving our U.S. economy forward. I'm very happy to be here, and it's a great honor to help recognize the great work of our Hispanic chambers from around the country, selected to receive this very prestigious award from the USACC. You, chamber leaders, play a very important role representing and being a resource to Hispanic-owned businesses in your local markets. Believe me, I have done that. I've spent more than 10 years being a chamber leader at what I call home, which is Tennessee, where I spent more than half of my life. Now joining forces with the USACC together, juntos, we are set for great success. It is well known that Hispanic-owned businesses are leading overall small, small business growth at a rate that is three to one compared to the general market. And this is vital to every worker, given that more than 70% of new jobs in our country are created by small businesses. Can I hear another applause for that? It can no longer be said that we are here to take your job. Instead, we surely can give you one. <laughs> Thanks to business leaders and organizations like the ones you represent, Hispanic-owned businesses have the opportunity to be part of this wonderful convention. I'm proud to be among all of you. It is also extremely rewarding to see that here we are together, speaking with one voice, an American voice, for unity and prosperity. And I know that through hard work, strategic partnerships, and entrepreneurship, we can move our country forward. Adelante! Thank you, USACC Board of Directors, the staff, and most importantly, the members and businesses of all sizes, who through hard work and determination, day after day, make our nation proud. Muchísimas gracias. And now, I have the great honor of presenting the 2018 Chamber of the Year Awards. Let's give a round of applause. Thank you. To our first recipient, which is the Greater Quad Cities Hispanic Chamber of Commerce. Woo! Thank you for your hard work. Our second recipient is the Hispanic Chamber of Commerce of Metropolitan St. Louis. Let's give them a round of applause. Welcome.
finally, our last recipient is the Little Village Chamber of Commerce located in Chicago, Illinois. Let's give a big round.